I do think that in the United States at least, we're on a rising tide of interest for the time being in the true crime genre. Uh, you had Making a Murderer, and I think you, you know, you'll see others. The O.J. Simpson case got renewed attention after Making a Murderer, but we're in a period of rising interest, and that has been coupled with a broader public discussion um, about criminal justice magnified, I think, by social media, or made an, a discussion made more effective by social media, of the people who've selected themselves to write to me. About two-thirds have spoken about their reaction to what they perceive as an injustice, that the system shouldn't work that way, that the process troubled them in some way. Law enforcement officers often, they, they'll typically say, look, I have no idea whether your guy did it or didn't do it. I don't care. I don't like what I saw about the process. I've probably gotten per capita more emails from Ireland and then also from the UK than from any country outside the United States. And the Irish very often say, oh, you know, this reminded me of a time we had in the 1970s. That's been a very common Irish reaction, is that it, it touches a chord with a shared historical, if not personal, experience. Events of the last several years, certainly including the November election and um, the beginning of the Trump administration, have reminded Americans that democracy is not a passive project because I think democracy really, in the end, uh, also needs civil conversation um, and a willingness to listen to other viewpoints as well as actively and, if necessarily, loudly proclaiming your own viewpoint.